Hi, it's Mary from Restoration Fitness. Helping people over 50 move with confidence, strength, and energy. So today, I'm going to talk again about backs and back pain. Because it's interesting that our lifestyle is contributing a lot to people ending up with back pain and perhaps seeking help with their physician or trying new stretches or going to yoga classes. And all those things are a good solution, but they're not the key solution. And the key solution is to develop your internal stabilizer muscles. So you've got three different muscle groups that all work together to support and contribute to your core. And the muscle group I want to talk about right now is deep inside. It's called your internal stabilizers. They are critical for supporting your back. It's like your diaphragm that moves up and down beneath your lungs as you breathe. Your pelvic floor, your multifidus muscles, which are very small spindly muscles that attach to each and every vertebra in your back. Those muscles contribute a major portion of the stability of your spine. So, we have to train those. There are people who are very strong in some of the more superficial muscles in their core, but they still lack that stability deep inside that makes a huge difference on whether you're stable and safe or if you're unbalanced and potentially going to end up with an injury when life just sends you in a different direction all of a sudden. So let's talk about how to strengthen them. I have two exercises today, very simple, that you can do to strengthen those internal stabilizer muscles that attach right to your vertebra in your spine. So you'll need to be on your floor or secondarily on your bed. But an interesting side note, if you can go down and lift yourself up from the floor as an active aging person, it is a key indicator of longevity. People who can no longer get up and down off the floor, their longevity estimates go way, way down. So, little point, let's start getting back on the floor and save your life. So, here we go. Let's work on those internal stabilizers. You're going to have bent knees. Your feet are hip width apart. Feet, knees, hips, and shoulders will all be in line on the floor. Your arms are out at your side. Very important point. Bring that belly button gently in. Keep breathing. Lift your pelvic floor. Keep breathing and keep it compressed as we do marches. So you will glue that low back to the floor, belly is in, and let's lift one foot and lower. Lift the other foot, hold two seconds, lower, and so forth. Just like you're marching in air, Keeping this low back on the floor, strengthening those muscles that you need. That's an amazing exercise. It seems simple, but it pays huge dividends. So, the second exercise I personally really love because it eliminated chronic back pain for me. We're back with those feet on the floor, hip width apart, in line with knees, pelvis, and shoulders. We're engaging our belly by bringing that belly button in gently, lifting that pelvic floor. You are going to squeeze your glutes, take a breath in, and as you exhale, gently lift your pelvis. Now you want a straight line from your shoulders to your knees. You do not want to do this 
where you're hyper extending your back. You want a straight line. Hold it for two seconds and slowly lower down again. Link this with your breath and you're actively engaging that diaphragm, which is another one of those stabilizers. So, everything's compressed, including glutes. Take a breath in. Exhale, lift. Hold for a count of two. And bring it down again. These are a daily thing to do. It will take you less than five minutes but it will make you feel so much better. And also the ability to get up off that sofa or out of your chair if you've been reading a lot or surfing the web or whatever. Those breaks and re-engaging those muscles in your spine can really help. So I hope you enjoyed that today. Please feel free to share this. Let me know any comments that you have or how you're going to integrate this in your life. Again, Restoration Fitness. Take care.